Mm -hmm. Hi, how are you guys? Hey, Kalena, how are you, girl? <laughs> Hola. Hey. Hola. Come on, hi. <laughs> Long time without seeing you. Hey. Last week. Yeah, it's awesome. What happened to you yesterday? Oh, yesterday I had a, a, a meeting with my a group of the church. Oh, got it, got it, yes. Yes. I got it. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Go. Oh, okay. <laughs> How are no, you? <laughs> oh, pretty good. Thank you so much for asking. I'm ready for you guys. I'm wondering. I already have the certificate, uh, teacher. Yeah. What kind of work? Congratulations. Yeah. Me too. You too? That's yes. amazing. Good job, guys. Thank you. <laughs> Kalena, did you send the papers for the next model? Yes, three times. And I have another email from Jason mm -hmm. uh, asking about, about the papers. And I say, I, I, I already sent it. I hope. Okay. They, they I, got I, it. I, I had it. Uh -huh. oh, I sent it, send it, send it today. I sent it today. Yeah, they're I, still I, on the on the enrollment issue, guys, and everything. So, well, you got to be patient with them, right? Because right? I received a message from them yesterday. So basically, uh, we just got to wait until they recollect every, anything or everything from the guys. And if they do have any issues with your papers or they need use something else, whatever, they will contact you directly, okay? okay. Do you know if you're going to be you? a teacher next next model? <laughs> you know, oh, everybody asks you the same question. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, I'm going to be a teacher, but I don't know if I'm going to be your teacher. Okay. It's because I wanted to show you something before, if we don't have classes anymore i want to show you something that can help you um yeah of course why not of course okay i know that you use powerpoint a lot like yeah. me, in my classes and i have this uh wacom tablet yeah can you see it? yeah i do i and i use it with powerpoint really uh-huh uh -huh. for to write exercises to solve exercises and i would like if you permit this to show you how to use it. That would be Just awesome, one, why not? One minute. Yeah, okay. of course, why not? Can, can I share my screen? Yeah, yeah. Double go ahead, sure. Okay. Okay, in PowerPoint, there are some tools that you can use here. Uh -huh. so, uh, when you open, there is a tool that says drawing, drawing. Draw, yeah. Uh -huh. So if you have this, uh, you can use it, for example, in my case, I use it for exercises mm -hmm. to write equation or, okay, uh, let me see. Uh, let me see. What is 20% of 30, for example? <laughs> and um, I can write the answer here, okay? Or the process. Okay. Uh, 0 0.2 times 30 or equals uh, six, or just two times three equals six. See? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's, re it's really fun. So if you, if you are writing in your PowerPoint, this tool is really effective. Oh, so you're writing mm -hmm. on the little thing that you show it to me. Exactly, this one. Ah, uh-huh. Oh, and good, that's nice. A lot of people don't know that we have these tools in PowerPoint. So I'm giving you this advice. Yeah, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you. Welcome. Of course. Thank you, Mario. Yeah. <laughs> For everybody. Of course. <laughs> no, thank you so much. That's amazing. But let me ask you something, Marito. Where did you uh, get that tool? Okay. Uh, this is one tool that um, the my department shared with us at the ABC. Ah. Uh -huh. uh, but I bought it. I, I bought a, an, the old version mm -hmm. on Amazon. Oh, Amazon. Amazon. All righty. Uh -huh. I paid at that time $69. I, oh. I believe this, this one because it is a Wi Fi one. It's oh, Wi Fi one? Ex, uh -huh, it's a little bit more expensive, That's but it's amazing. It's a really good tool. That's great. Uh, but that, that is including taxes or without taxes? Uh, well, with taxes, uh, it's like one, $130. Mm -hmm. 
that's affordable. All right, excellent. Uh, what is the name of that tool? Okay, it's a Wacom tablet. Wacom tablet. Wake, okay. Wacom tablet. They, they usually use these tablets to draw. To oh, draw. okay, got it. Uh, uh huh. And you just connect it with your computer and everything? Yeah, you just need to download the drivers. Oh, okay. Install, okay. install the drivers and everything works. Wow, that's awesome. You know, I never don't know that because of course I do not use it, right? Uh, of course, of course. But it's a, a great tool if you want to, um, for example, write big sentences or instead yeah. of typing. Mm -hmm. Wacom. All right, that's amazing. Is it I'm going to send you right? the link. Wacom yes, Tablet. please, please, please do. Yeah, you're going to send it to the WhatsApp? Okay, perfect. That's I amazing. Hi, Alex. <laughs> Hi, Carito. Hello, good, Hello, good evening. Hi, Luis. How are you, sir? Hey, Luis is here. So that's amazing. Yeah. Are you happy to see Mr. Luis? <laughs> Yeah, I'm so happy. I saw the 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 what? yesterday class, and uh -huh. I wonder what kind of work do you do? Uh, I, I was I was thinking I, I was wondering right about <laughs> what uh, you can no, explain no, 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 to me no. anything mm -hmm. about grammar, uh, you know, all the stuff. So I was like, very so simple. Uh -huh. no, 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 no. I was wondering if you were supposed to ask me that, but uh, I didn't know that you were going to ask me that question. Uh, I will let you know later on. <laughs> you leave the question yesterday. <laughs> ah, yeah, I did. I'm fine, thanks. Hey, Luisito. All right. He's fine, he said. That's cool. Uh, 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 I, I will let you know at, at the end, right? Okay. <laughs> no, I will it's send okay. you. No, what I'm going to do, I'm going to send you that I'm information kidding, to the I'm WhatsApp. Okay? Because Paquito know, also was wondering about that. Actually, Paquito is the one who made me that question. Right, Paquito? And Paquito's like, what are you talking about? You know, man, man. All righty. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Alex, you look more, um, I don't know, how, how can I say it, with more energy today than yesterday. Really? Yeah, yesterday you were like, <laughs> and now <laughs> you, you, I, yeah, you feel, I look at you and you're like, yeah, I don't know, happy, sometimes why. happier. I don't know why. Sometimes it happens. Well, it, imagine that we're coming from weekends, right, guys? And most of the time, so. we do a lot of leisure activities and other stuff. And then we have to wake up really early morning and on Monday. So we have to, like, start all over again the routine. So I think that that's what causes that sometimes we feel, like, lazy on Mondays. I hate Mondays. <laughs> I hate them by heart. Because for me, it's really hard to wake up. <laughs> well, I wake up uh, really early every day except for Saturday. Because basically, that is my day off, if I can say that. Actually, I don't have a day off, but it is my day off. So I, that day, I tried to wake up at 8, 8.30. Once I was really tired, I woke up at 11. <laughs> can you imagine? But mm -hmm. that was really weird. Really, really weird. All right, guys. Yesterday, we were talking about simple past and past continuous, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. And we were talking about, uh, you were uh, giving us uh, like examples of all your stories and all the stuff. So that was amazing. Hey, I, I think, Alex, you didn't mention your story, right? Yeah, I didn't. You did? Okay, so <laughs> we're ready to listen yeah. to you. <laughs> Don't worry, we're go we're going to keep on trying Me this too. class. Yes, of course, yeah. Marito, I know, but hold your um, words. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm impatient to, to tell my story. Okay, go ahead. We are impatient yeah. too. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, Alex. Oh, what yeah. do you have for us? Um, I was uh, just, uh, I remember the um i was with my friends you know we went to a river uh-huh which river uh, by the way uh it's in in the past yeah. mm. you yeah. don't you don't remember do you remember the name no is it he was he was okay yeah yeah I, I know that he was he was river yeah okay yeah we were uh 
swimming, you know, mm -hmm. uh, catching, no, <laughs> catching some, <laughs> some, uh, some fish, crabs, crabs. Really? Oh, that's nice. And then you make a soup. <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? I, mean, I was kidding. Sometimes, yeah, but, but hey. something. Really, it's really delicious, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah I remember one, one day we were uh, swimming and we saw a, a, a little huge snake. Really? Over. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, it was passing over the stones. Rocks. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> the stones yeah, that were on the on the river. Yeah, yeah. Hey, look river. at Paquito's well, you know, mango. River, river side. Oh, oh, yeah. oh oof, okay. <laughs> yeah, we saw and and um and I think it was I was it was chasing some uh, thoughts because mm -hmm. thoughts, right? Yeah. Yeah. But you know, we were surprised because the the size of, of the snakes. Yeah. The size a little, a little, of the big, diameter? Like yeah, the diameter. Yeah, like this. Thick. Oh my yeah. goodness. It's really wide. Yeah. What about the long? Yeah, about two two meters. Almost two meters. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I will have a heart attack. <laughs> really? But what kind yeah, of but snake was usual. it? What does the, the normal the massacre. Boa? No? Boa, boa. Yeah, it's a kind yeah, boa. All right. It's, oh. it's the, I think it's the, the usual. Yeah, thing. they're like a mouse hunters, right? Boas. Yeah. 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 We call it a massacre. Oh, yes, yes. Exactly. So basically, they do not hurt uh, human, right? Human beings. No, no. Okay. Uh, as long as you respect them. Uh, but they they go to you, know, the house. It goes into the house to, okay. to try when try to to uh, to chase some chickens. Ah, uh, okay. Chicks. So they eat it. Yeah, they. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oof. That's the issue you you find. Oh my God! Hey, yeah. what but what happened? All of them were were men, right? So they they do they get yeah, scary we or no? Like, no. No. <laughs> no. You say hi, snake. How some, are you? Some, Baba, yeah, girl. some of the guys, you know, they try to to catch <laughs> or. or Hey, yeah. but that was amazing. How old were you by then? I uh, was, was like, um, mm, you, in, in about 2012, something like that. So, the, we were, we how were, old? Like 30s? <laughs> no. <30s what? laughs> you were in your 30s when that happens? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm not a 50. I'm not saying that. I'm, I'm not saying that you're old. Come on. No. no I think what, what's something? 2010? Uh, yeah, 2010. 2010. So yeah. you were in your 30s. <laughs> <laughs> and you see, guys, he doesn't want to say how old is he. <laughs> you know, was he you by sure. then? <laughs> uh, <laughs> you but shave your, your beard. You be, exactly. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I, I shave your. You know? you, yeah, you did. I think <laughs> I noticed that. But let me this ask is... you: Were you married already when that Sorry. happens? No. No. Ah, you were single. Yeah. Ah, okay. I got married. I got married like five years ago. Five years ago. That means mm. it's 2015. Yeah. So mm. I think you were younger. You were on your 20s, right? <laughs> <laughs> that was a really awesome story thank you alex great thank job you. okay now let's listen to marito hey marito what about you okay well my story is about what happened on sunday on sunday, on sunday okay. i had uh, last sunday i had a game mm -hmm. but while i was playing basketball i fell down <laughs> on, the, on the ground on the okay ground. awesome <laughs> my, my team believe i was joking because i didn't stand up quickly but <laughs> i didn't get up because my knees hurt a lot oh sorry to hear you that know, that's what happened when you're playing too much and you are like uh -huh, uh, above 40 <laughs> uh -huh. You pretend that you're still a dumb man, right? And you're exactly, not anymore. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. You're jumping too much and everything, you know. So I'm taking some pills for okay. the pain, and that Ooh. helps me. And that wow. helps me. But uh, I need to calm down mm -hmm. when I'm playing. Yeah, yeah I you know. know. Uh, emotions just come out, and 
and I I try to be young again. When uh, I'm yeah, and because you got so excited, right? And uh, maybe you like um, I don't know. Maybe you didn't stretch out and warm it up uh, a lot, so that could be. It's part maybe. of that. Oh, I'm or sorry. I, or I need some new knees. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> no, you're still done. You're in your 40s. Come on. Like Alex is in his 30s, you know? <laughs> Who, else know. Didn't, yeah. know. Yeah. <laughs> Who else didn't mention a story yesterday? I think Carito, you did, right? Lenny? Kalena. Oh, Kalena. Uh, Kale no, but Kalena, was, she wasn't here. Yeah, so hold your horses. She's like, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Righty, let me check. Uh, Carito, did you mention a story yesterday? I didn't think so. Yeah. I don't think so. You did? When I found the money. Oh, yeah, the money, 150 bucks, right? Ooh. Yeah, 175. You no, 175. <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. Can you imagine, guys? She found what? 175 bucks. Ooh. What do you buy with the money? Uh -huh. What did you do? What do you do? it? Um, I don't remember. <laughs> she went to the hair salon, I think. That, you know? Sarah. No, no, no. I think I yeah. bought clothes. You clothes? Yeah. Ah, okay, cool. Yeah. I well, guess, yeah. If I got that money, I will invite my Sarah. mama to have a really great dinner in a restaurant. In my case. <laughs> yes. Yes, but no. I <laughs> just. <laughs> okay. No, actually, I used to invite my mom to a dinner or a. I don't know, a lunch, mm -hmm. uh, every time I got paid. Hey, me too. We're exactly the same. Yeah. <laughs> it's a tradition. Yeah, for me it's a tradition. I love, I love yeah. to share. I love to share and spend time with my family and my friends. Yeah. My husband said, you're spending too much money on uh, food. But I said, well, but I love to do that. Yeah. <laughs> to buy you. I love to buy my mama. Um, when of course I, I, I we need to like you know your budget right each of us we have a budget right that you know yeah. how much we can spend on this and this and this and this and so uh i can't afford it so i want to buy you so why not you know what i'm not a stingy i'm not stingy with related to food or related to health i'm not because it's worth it yeah so if it's money if it's money needs for food or for health doesn't matter how much it costs. Yes, of course. Especially for my family and my friends. And of course, for my pets. Because they are my babies. Mm -hmm. They are my and babies. And for your students. And for my, and for my pets. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> well, you know what? I wish... Well, if I if I give you physically classes, yes, you know I remember once we were studying like um, English at the airport, and at the end of the course we made like a Hawaiian party for my students. So I prepare a special place, uh, decorate and everything, and as well a friend of mine who also had like the um, how you said that bakery in English. I'm sorry, but the, the French word came up on my mind. I apologize. That is a but it's a bakery actually, and they made like a little like a little breads that I can insert like sausage inside, and I make some decoration with pineapples and I don't know, right? So that was I tried to like like a Hawaiian tropic idea, right? And also I put um on the top of the place I put two two Hawaiian words like ohana and aloha. You know what? Ohana means family, right? That's what it means in Spanish. So basically I tried to like, it was simple, but I tried to like express them how much I care about them. So if we had opportunity, I wish I could share with you physically, but I can't. <laughs> well, not right now, but maybe in the future, why not, right? I, I, I'm not sure if I want to change this or physical classes. I <laughs> love these classes at this time and I don't want to dry at 8 p.m. <laughs> of course, of course. No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that if we had a chance to be physically each, with each other, that, it, that, would be, that, that would be nice, right? But of yeah. course, I love I mean, classes at night. Me too. I love them. <laughs> I love them by heart, definitely. Hey, talking about love them, thank you so much for uh, for sharing your stories. I love it. Uh, but today, guys, 
Uh, do you remember that today we're gonna focus on two skills? That pronunciation, especially when we're talking about long sentences or complex sentences like yesterday. Sometimes we're like, we are going to say like two ideas, like a huge sentences like that. And you were like, <laughs> and then you continue speaking like, <laughs> right? So we need to like uh, learn where we need to make the intonation when we need to go up and then we need to go out. Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now, basically, I will uh, play with you an audio and I want you just to listen, just to listen and try to catch up the pronunciation or where do you think they um, stop and make the intonation goes down. And after that, I will share with you the sentences. So you will be able to see and at the same time listen and focus on where you need to put the intonation in which part of the sentence because actually it's a huge sentence two ideas making into one so uh thank you so much lenny you you came in a really really good time you know <laughs> yes let the party start man yeah yeah oh, yeah i love kirby you know what i love is love his cat you know why Kalena? because a cat is looking for a wi-fi all the time <laughs> so that's what I love. Yeah, it's moving the tail of this. Ooh, ooh. Where's the wife? Where's the wife? Okay, so let me just a couple of minutes. Let me share it right now on my screen with you. And uh, try to identify, guys, first of all, in which part of the sentence they uh, put the intonation and the intonation goes down. Page 23, exercise four, pronunciation. Intonation in complex sentences. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice how each clause in a complex sentence has its own intonation pattern. While divers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. As Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked it into the wrong goal. Okay, you wanted to put it one more time? Yes, please. Okay. Thank you. You're more than welcome. Page 23, exercise four, pronunciation. Intonation in complex sentences. Part A, listen and practice. Notice how each clause in a complex sentence has its own intonation pattern. While divers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. As Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked it into the wrong goal. All right. Okay, guys. So now I'm going to share right now with you the, the writing, okay? The writing exercise, the writing sentences. And I want you guys to pay attention about where is the intonation, okay? Where you need to like slow down a little bit and then like... Take a, a little bit breath and continue speaking, okay? Uh, let me just a couple of minutes. Let me share right now what screen. Actually, guys, the ideas, they were separated by comma, the two ideas, but they, they it, is, it is one two ideas becoming to one sentence. So basically, I just want you guys to notice where you need to like put the intonation down because actually in both sentences, you have to slow down a little bit. So let me just a couple of minutes and let me share right now with you. And just let me know as soon as you receive it, okay? Because basically guys, what we're working right now, we're working how each class in a complex sentence has its own intonation. That's what we are working right now. I just sent it to you a few minutes, a few seconds ago. Did you receive it? Yep. All right, cool. So now I'm gonna play the audio one more time. And please guys, take a look that this complex sentence, we have two classes. Each class is divided by comma, if you can see that. All right, so what I want you to notice is how each class, even though it's a one complex idea it, it, that has 
two sentences, but each clause has a, its own intonation. So I just want you guys to take a look at that, okay? I'm gonna play the audio one more time, and at the same time, please read the sentences. Just allow me one couple of minutes, let me do it again. There you go. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay, guys, there you go. Page 23, exercise four, pronunciation. Intonation in complex sentences. Part A, listen and practice. Notice how each clause in a complex sentence has its own intonation pattern. While divers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. As Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked it into the wrong goal. One more time, or oh, are we okay? Okay, we are okay. Are you, is everybody okay? Paquito, Alex, Kalena, yeah. Luis, yeah, okay. All right, okay, guys. So let's practice the intonation, okay? But most of the time, I want you guys to practice the fluency. This fluency when you're talking, okay? All righty. Especially, guys, when you need to, like, join, like, uh, phrasal verse. That's what I want. So, volunteer, thank you so much. All righty. Kirby, what do you have for us? Don't worry, Marito. Don't worry. For the first time in the model, it's not going to be you. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, Kirby, go ahead. And then, Paquito. First of all, Kirby, go ahead. Uh... While, while divers were working on the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. Uh huh. Do me a favor. Can you please uh, do it again, especially working off? Okay. While divers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered the shipwreck. Okay. Uh, almost perfect, except for the, the name of the state is Florida. Florida. Oh, okay. Florida. So do it again. Okay, while well, drivers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. Aha, uh -huh. and it's also there, there's, there's one more thing. We have two off there, right? We have an off with double F and one with one F. Is that right? Yeah. Okay, so the one with uh, double F, we pronounce it off. Because uh, that, more, that means it turn it off, it turn it off. However, the one with OF, we put it with of. Of, like O and E and V. So you said, yeah. well, divers were working off the cause of, of, is the cause of, the cause of Florida? You see, the cause of. Okay. Is the difference pronunciation? I know it yeah, sounds a little bit sutil, but you can try it. Go yeah. ahead. Okay, while well, the drivers were working off of the cause of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. The Florida, the no, Florida, Florida. Florida, ah, okay. Do it again. Come on, you can do it. Oh, God. Mon Dieu. While divers were working up because of Florida. Florida. Ah. Again. While divers were working up because of Florida, they discovered a shiver. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations to you. Great job. Marito said Thank we're you. going to sit until 10 because of him. No, that's not way. <laughs> that's okay. Very good, Kirby. Excellent job. You say mon dieu, right? Yeah. You say mon dieu? Mon dieu. Oui. 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 Ah, he passed the français. Oui. 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 He speaks French. Oui. I apologize. Okay. <laughs> I'm sad because of that. I'm just kidding. Désolé. Okay. Uh, what about the second one? The second sentence. Also you, Kirby. Kirby. Second one as well, as well, second yes, one. Yes, both of them, please. Okay. As Jake was running toward the, the ball, he tripped and kicked into the wrong wall. Uh, 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 you see, uh, I know, I know. That's why we're practicing the fluency line. Like, okay, do it again. You can do it. Okay, as okay, as Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked, kicked, hit it, hit it into the two wrong wall. It's like a, it's like a tongue and twister, right? Uh huh. Uh, like, <laughs> you gotta say and kick it into. You see, and kick it into, kick, kick it into, kick it into, into. Kick kick it into. In. like okay. kick it, like kick it into. <laughs> Thanks God he's not here. <laughs> like a rooster, right? Kick it into. Kick it, like, like kick it, kick, 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 like that yeah. exactly, like a rooster. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right, you can do it. Okay, as Dave was running toward the ball, he tripped with and kick it into the wrong. Yay! Ball. Very good. You see, always remember the rooster. <laughs> <laughs> 
I, I, will, yeah. I will never Great forget Great job, it. my man. Excellent. Phew. All righty. Very good. Paquito. <laughs> Next big thing. Uh, a big plaisir, monsieur. Uh, you're more than welcome, sir. Uh, Paquito, the next big thing. Sorry, the next participant. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. That sounds good. Yeah, go ahead, sir. Okay. While divers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. Very good. All right. Look at his pose. Wild divers. All right. Very good. Okay, the next one, sir, please. Go ahead. Okay, as Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked it into the wrong goal. My goodness, you're awesome. And look at his pose, like, and kicking it the wrong goal. That's good. Excellent, great <laughs> job. Uh -huh. And Curry said, thanks Thank to me much. that I made it like a thousand of times. So I was the first big thing. <laughs> Curry, now I'm teasing you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Very good job. Excellent, Paquito. All right, next big team. Sorry, next participant. Marito, go ahead. What do you have for us? Okay. Uh, while divers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a shipwreck. Very good. Excellent. Go ahead. As, yes, uh, as, as Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kick it into the wrong ball. Yeah, that's amazing. Good job, sir. Give me double five. Woohoo! Yeah, all right. <laughs> and I bought another volunteer. Carito, go ahead. <laughs> okay. You're so mean. Well, Did you know? were working off the coast of Florida, they discover a shipwreck. Yeah. As Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked it and kick it into the wrong goal. You see, very good. You <laughs> always remember Rooster and you will never give up. <laughs> very good, excellent. Next big team, uh, Lenny, what you have for me? Go ahead, sir. Lenny. Okay. Hello. Hello, sir. Me? Yes, of course. Uh, please um, give me a second. Give me a second, already passed, sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, while drivers were working divers. on the coast of Florida, divers, drivers, no, divers, divers yes, okay, sorry. go ahead, you can do it. Okay, while divers were working on the coast of Florida, they discovered that she break. Mm -hmm. As Jake was running toward the ball, he tripped and kicked it into the wrong goal. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. Ah, you were practicing right now. <laughs> Very yeah. good job. Yeah, great job, Lenin. Excellent job. Amazing. Uh, and Kirby said, yes, I was the big thing. <laughs> Just kidding, Kirby. <laughs> All righty. Who's next? Uh, Sergio, you want to try? Sergio, Sergio, Sergio. Sergio's here, but I don't know if he's physically here. Mr. Sergio, first call. Mr. Sergio, second call. This is Sergio, third call. Okay, I think he's not here. Let's uh, let's give him a chance. Alex, what about you? What do you have for us? Ah, I knew what he said. Yeah. Uh, while drivers were working off the coast of Florida, they discovered a street break. Mm -hmm. as, as Jake was running toward to the ball, he tripped and kicked it off kick it into the wrong goal very good and kick it you see the rooster works excellent <laughs> job my man very good Thanks. kalena what about you my girl now it's a ton <laughs> okay while divers were working off the coast of florida they discovered a chipwreck as jake was running toward the ball he tripped and kicked it into the wrong goal. Very good, but no, he tripped. He tripped. He tripped. He tripped. Very he good. He tripped. Very good. Excellent okay. job, Maria Ernestina. You wanna try? Maria Ernestina, you wanna try? Hopefully, she's here. Hello, oh, and I think she's playing with the dog. <laughs> that might be. <laughs> okay, Luis, Rene, would you like to try? Is it Louis here? He's here, right? But I don't know. 
He was here. But... He was here. He left. He le no, he's here. I see him. I Luis. Yeah, me too. Rene Martinez, yes. Where? Well, maybe we need to give him some time. Let's ask uh, Maria Ernestina once oh, again yeah. if she's here. Hey, I like your background, Marito. All righty. Well, let's move on. Okay, maybe they're like taking a glass of water or a cup of coffee. I don't know. That that might be the reason, right? Or right. something else. And don't, I don't want to get into details about that. <laughs> All right. Very good. So, like, guys, let's continue. Now, what I'm going to do, because we were, we were uh, working on not only to speaking, guys, but at the same time listening, right? So, let me ask you, the third time that you listened to skill and you're at the same time you read, was it easier for you or no? Was it a little bit easier? Because it's really hard when you have just to, to listen something, right? But when you have physically something and then listen, I mean, developing the two skills is a little bit easier, right? Because you have something physical. Okay. Yes, you yeah. can read their, their mouth. Mm -hmm, exactly. Now, because I want you guys to develop, uh, I know I'm, I've been focusing all the model basically on the listening part because I know that is one of the hardest skills to develop. So right now, we'll continue with the speaking, okay? Don't worry about that. But we will also continue with the listening part. And right now, what we are going to do is to also listen, guys, about three stories. Three stories, okay? Uh, but first of all, the first time that I'm going to play this audio, all that I want you to know or to let me know is which of the pictures that I'm going to send it to you right now, which of the pictures are mentioned and which one is the one that is not. Because I'm going to send you four pictures and only three of them are mentioned. There is a fourth one that is not there. So all that I want you to let me know in this first step of the listening part is to let me know which one is the number one, which one is the number two, and which one is number three. That's all that I need. You got it? Okay, okay I haven't sent it to you. Sorry, I apologize. Did you receive it already, guys? Yep, you did? Yeah. Yes. Okay, cool. So you can see four pictures there, one with the police officer. There's another two girls on the, on the beach. Uh, there's one girl talking about with the police and the other one is having a snake, right? Alex, yeah, hey, I think mm. it's Alex. Ah, I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah. yeah, maybe it's you, right? <laughs> okay, so basically, guys, this is what I want. Just let me know uh, which is the story. You need to number from one to three because there is one extra picture there. So just allow me one moment. Let me double check here. I'm going to share right now my screen with you. There you go. Okay, so bear with me. Okay, you already have the pictures, so just listen carefully to the stories and let me know which one is the one that is not mentioned. Exercise five, listening. In the news, part A. Listen to three news stories. Number the pictures from one to three. There is one extra picture. One. A man was seriously injured on Sunday by a three-and-a-half-meter snake in a town in Thailand. It seems that the man ran over to see the snake after friends told him that it was beside one of the town's main roads. The man put it around his neck, and while he and his friends were walking home, the snake squeezed more and more tightly. Luckily, the man got the snake off his neck in time. Two. Two teenage girls who disappeared from a ship were found alive and well. The girls turned up on Friday near a small town on the northeast coast of Australia. The girls said they were visiting a friend on the ship and fell asleep in their friend's cabin. When they woke up, the ship was heading for Singapore. So they jumped off the ship, swam to shore and had to walk for several days to get to the nearest town. Three. 
Early Tuesday morning in California, two police officers were chasing a car thief when they suddenly lost control of their vehicle and drove into a river. Surprisingly, the thief went back to the scene of the accident and helped rescue the officers from the river. The local police department dropped all charges against the thief for saving the officers' lives. Okay, guys. Okay, right now, you have the pictures. So tell me, which is the one that is not mentioned on the stories? Which ones? Which one? The police officer with the girl, talking with the girl. Talking with the girl. Yeah. Are you agree, guys? Okay. Yes. Cool. Yes. So now tell me, yeah. according to what you have heard, uh, which is the first picture that is that is mentioned in the story? Which is the first story? The last the one with the, the snake. Guys. The last yeah. one. The snake. The one with the snake. Okay, what about okay, number two? The two girls, the two teens. The two girls the, on, okay. The last on the, on the, the seashore? The one. <laughs> they were on the lost, seashore. Yeah. Okay, and what about the third one? The, the car police in the river. The police car under them. The okay. thief uh, saved them. Saving or rescue him, rescue them, right? Yeah, rescue them. I think so. Okay, cool. So now that you know which is the ones that they're mentioned, which is the one that is not, I so basically, picture number three is the one that is not mentioned, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. So right now, guys, we are working, developing the skill for listening to specific details. That's what we're doing right now. So now, guys, I'm going to play that story again, and I want you to do me a favor. Uh, I want you to uh, do this. Uh, one, two, three, and a piece of paper in your mind, whatever, uh, uh, a book, anything that you have. I want you to put one, two, three, which is the three stories. And on the top, I want you to put three questions. The first question that I want to, uh, that you put is, where did it happen? The second column or the second question will be, when did it happen? And the third one will be, what happened? All right? Okay. At the top, at the top of the page. Uh, I will send you like a, like, like a little example so you will have an idea because right now what we're going to do, we're going to listen to the story again, but we're going to get into details. So what I want you to do is just uh, try to, I don't pay attention to the whole story. All that I want you to do is to just to catch the three, the, the answer for the three questions. Mm -hmm. Where did it happen? When did it happen? And what happened? So let me just cap the minutes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm sending you right now an example, so bear with me for a moment. I almost there. There you go. Okay, cool. <laughs> Let me send you an example. Okay, I sent it to you an example. Do you receive it? Yeah. Yep. Okay, so it's si similar to that is what I want you to do. You can do it in the Word. Uh, I don't know, in a PowerPoint, I don't know, in a notepad, sticky note, whatever. Or in your book, of course, like Kalena, that she's traditional, like a, a notebook, right, with a, with, a, with a pen or pencil. All right. So I will give you one minute. Let me know when you're ready. Is it, does, does everybody have uh, something to write on? Yeah? Okay, yeah. cool. Okay. Yes, Kike, no welcome. All right, Kike. You came in a really good time. Okay, so... Let me play the audio one more time, guys. And you know what? I'm gonna be I'm not gonna be a nice teacher today. Why? Because I'm not going to stop in each story. I will play it at once. And you try to try to get as much information as you can. Okay. Ready? All right. Here we go. Page 24, exercise five, listening. In the news, part A. Listen to three news stories. Number the pictures from one to three. There is one extra picture. One. A man was seriously injured on Sunday by a three-and-a-half-meter snake in a town in Thailand. 
It seems that the man ran over to see the snake after friends told him that it was beside one of the town's main roads. The man put it around his neck, and while he and his friends were walking home, the snake squeezed more and more tightly. Luckily, the man got the snake off his neck in time. 2. Two teenage girls who disappeared from a ship were found alive and well. The girls turned up on Friday near a small town on the northeast coast of Australia. The girls said they were visiting a friend on the ship and fell asleep in their friend's cabin. When they woke up, the ship was heading for Singapore. So they jumped off the ship, swam to shore, and had to walk for several days to get to the nearest town. 3. Early Tuesday morning in California, two police officers were chasing a car thief when they suddenly lost control of their vehicle and drove into a river. Surprisingly, the thief went back to the scene of the accident and helped rescue the officers from the river. The local police department dropped all charges against the thief for saving the officers' lives. All right. So... Okay, guys, I know it was hard, right? Was it hard? I know, a little bit. Yes, it was. It was. Okay, don't yeah. worry. You will improve it each time. So what I wanted to know is, um, okay, story number one was about the snake, right? Okay, so tell me, when did it happen? No, where, sorry. Where? 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 In, in Thailand. Thailand. In a town in, in a Thailand. small town in Thailand. All right, very good. In Thailand, yes. When did it happen? When? Sunday. 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 Morning, afternoon. Yeah. No, doesn't mention. Okay, cool. What happened? The snake is squeezed his neck. He put his yeah, the, the snake in his neck and in the squeeze. Like, right? Okay. Yeah, the man. Like, almost Alex passed away. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, no, no. But can you imagine? It was not Masaquata, right, Alex? It was that like Anaconda or something like that? No, or, but I think it's the same boy. It's the same boy, yeah? It's the same boy, but, but over there, I think. That mm -hmm. but you got to be careful with them, right? Because they're like... <sniffs> All right. What about number two? Where did it happen? It's in the North town. Coast. North in Australia. No, the North Coast in Australia, right? Okay, North Coast North of Australia. All right. So when oh, did yeah. it happen? When? On Friday. Friday. On, On Friday. 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 And what happened? Are the two teens ladies? Mm -hmm. They oh, were yeah. found. They were found because they were lost. Yeah, they were into a ship. They yeah. jumped from oh, the ship. Jumped. Okay, they were into the French ship. They jumped yeah. into the ship once they, they find out the that the ship uh, was supposed to go where? The nearest uh, town. No, of I'm course, her, damn, but what happened with the ship? Why was the reason they jumped? They lost. Uh huh, the but why? They sleep. Singapore. Yeah, to Singapore. To yeah, you see? Each of you mm -hmm. is uh, giving me this piece of information that I need. Very good, excellent. So, what happened? So, they, they, they jumped. jumped. <laughs> they jumped from the ship. They Very good. Work. They excellent. Work, they for six hours. And last, exactly. And last but not least, what happened with the number three? Where did it happen? In California. California, when? On Thursday morning. On Thursday morning, and what? Of the thief the, saved, saved the, the thief police, saved, the police officer. The police saving officer. His, yeah. Saving his life. Uh, the, the car fell release. down in the river. Yeah, exactly. So what happened? What What did the thief did? The, the thief helped the, the thief to save the rescue. A rescue. Uh, mm -hmm. rescue the, the, the police, police officer. officer. So what did the police uh, do to compensate the thief? <laughs> they they, 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 they he was absorbed. Or... They took, uh -huh. Uh -huh. For all uh -huh. the charges, right? Uh -huh. All right, very good, excellent. So now guys, we're gonna play this thing, okay? Uh, it very, very good. Excellent job, guys. I'm really, really proud of you. So we're going to do something, guys. Um, we're, go we're going to use our imagination right now, okay? Our imagination. And everybody's going to participate. So they say, no, sir, teacher, I don't know. Yes, you know, okay? Because 
Uh, we're doing all the stuff, guys, because I want you to get used to it, how you need to tell stories. And if you have seen, guys, all the listening activities that we have done so far, they were putting in practice uh, the burdens that we, that we saw yesterday, the past continuous and the simple past. So basically, guys, um, we are everybody together, together, we're going to make a complex story about something, right? So a people, a person, I don't know who, Alex, Galena, Paquito, Curvin, Carito, Luis, Mariana, I don't know, anybody could start the story. And you got to use your imagination because each of you will continue with the story until we'll make a whole soap opera. Not like a, um, <clears throat> Mr. Uh, what's the name of that guy that you were reading? Uh, Mr. Gabriel Garcia Marcus. No, not like that, of course. But uh, uh, you, you know what I mean, right? We're going, we need to continue with that. Okay, so you got to use your imagination because I can start even with while or with a past sense. I don't know. So let's start. Okay. You understand what we're going to do, guys? We're going to take turns, okay? Yeah. So continue with the idea until we did a really good so proper, or at least a really good story. So I have here this one. <laughs> this is really interesting. Uh, okay. Would you like me to use one of your names or I should invent? Okay, I should invent. <laughs> no. No, okay. Uh, this is a, one of our names. Are okay. Paquito, would you uh, would you be so kind and gentle if and if you allow me to use your name for this story? Go ahead. Go ahead. All righty. I love that. Cool. Thank you. <laughs> so let me start the story, okay? And I'm gonna choose which one continues with the story. So you gotta be ready, okay? So I need all your microphone off. Guys, on, sorry. All the microphones on. Kervin, Carito, Maria, Lenin, Lu Luis. I think Luis is working right now, so I'm not going to ask him because he's working, but he's there. He's, he sent me a message, okay? So he's there. Sergio, hopefully, and Ernestina. Hopefully, they are there as well because they haven't said anything, but Luis, yes. Kervin, are you still with us? Kervin, yes. I do, I do. Okay, cool. All righty. So let me start. Uh, but you have to turn it on your uh, your microphone, Mr. Kirby. Please. Okay. Cool. Very good. Thank you so much. So let me ask you, or let me start the story. While Paquito was traveling to South America, continue, Marito. He found a, a good city to visit. Okay. In, uh -huh. in Peru. In Peru. All right, so oh, continue, man. continue, Kalena. <laughs> yes, you can do it. <laughs> while Paquito was traveling to America, did you say no, that? No, I, I said, I while Paquito was uh -huh. traveling to South America, Mario South said America? he found a really good city to visit in Peru. That's what he said. So continue. Oh. Um, he, um, he, he was, he were, he was, uh, he was uh, at Machu Picchu. He went to Machu Picchu. Uh, <laughs> he went to Machu Picchu and, uh -huh. and visited uh, uh -huh. and visited and she's like <laughs> sequences. <Yeah>. Okay, <laughs> and visited, continue curving and visited. Uh, I visited um, his parent house and there. To beat you, okay. Okay, this is a question of story, isn't it? Oh, yeah. uh, and and there uh, he he uh, and there was a, a neighborhood and he fell in love. Her. He fell in love. Okay, Carito, he fell in love. Oh my goodness, that's really good. Continue, Carito. Okay. Um, the next day when he was walking with the love when, when of he was life. walking or while he walking. was walking while he was walking with the love of his life oh my goodness that's really good it sounds like shakespeare <laughs> <laughs> he, he met um other people uh, other it was other girl people. my goodness okay other interesting people okay 
and other interesting people. Okay, Alex, continue. Ah, me? Yes, you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, finally, he was happy. <laughs> okay, that's no. it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> finally, he was happy. Why? <laughs> Because he found his, he's found his, his love, you know. No, but he, but Carito said that he met another people. Yeah, but. Um, uh huh. Continue with the idea. He find, yeah, he found a. Uh, he made um, one of uh, one of the friends. <laughs> okay, one other friends. Okay, okay, leave it like that way. Lenin. Okay, continue with the idea. Uh, I think I lost, but uh, after that, uh, he was hungry. He was hungry, okay. <laughs> and looking for a good place to enjoy a good typical meal. Okay, with who? With and his great... uh -huh. He got romantic and invited his great Peruvian love. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh to a God. romantic dinner. Ooh, very good. Continue, okay. Carito. <laughs> then in the restaurant, he saw um, his friend mm -hmm. who he was, he, he, <laughs> he <laughs> have seen the, I don't know, earlier uh -huh. that thing. Okay. So, they, they, um, I don't know, found. They found. He, he, uh, no, excuse me. He found that that friend have had, had a relationship with the girl that is dating with him. Oh my wow. god! So oh no! Oh my god! You like complex story, right? Oh yeah. All right. So Marito, go it ahead. That's a tough one. Suddenly, suddenly, suddenly? Okay. He, he received a phone call. All right. Ring, ring, and he saw the number and started trembling. Started, started trembling. Uh -huh. Okay. It was his wife. Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> the original wife. Oh, my, oh my God, goodness. Is... You're like a some poppers, by the way. Okay. okay. We're gonna uh, bring... Okay, Lenny, no, now is your turn. <laughs> We're gonna win a uh, 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 a Grammy, good. yes, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so continue, Alex. Guys, can you hear me? Yes, Luis, we can hear you. Yeah. All right. You can, that, would you like to continue? Zoom is. I, I was having a notification that says that my microphone and my speaker are not working. But they, I have to but use they are. A different connection. Yes, you are right. That's why I was not speaking. Mm -hmm. Would right, you like thanks. to continue with the story? Uh, no, thanks. I'm going to listen. Okay, that's okay, Luis. All right, Alex, go ahead. Um, so he, he received a call, a call right? Uh -huh, from the original wife, right? <laughs> uh -huh. um, He's in a great trouble. Yeah, he had. Uh, <laughs> he had to had to resolve the, the problem, and talk to uh, sincerely with his uh, original wife if he if he he's continue loving her or 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 if he's gonna change for 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 the other lady. No? Oh my goodness! And then what happened, Kirby? And then, <laughs> uh, well, he was thinking about what yeah, it, what he was, was supposed thinking, to do. He was thinking that it was impos impossible because his wife, uh, it was died already. Already, oh. the original <laughs> wife passed away. The original wife is already died, so for that it was impossible. And this, this changed was, completely, uh, right? That scenario. <laughs> <laughs> All okay. right. And I don't know. You, I don't know. Continue this day. <laughs> this is the story. Yeah. Can, can you imagine? Paquita said, "Well, I figure it out that I need to return back to El Salvador." <laughs> oh. 
Oh yeah, but he's in trouble because he, he got the, the two, I, two songs. I was thinking about what to do after I received the call. <laughs> and, 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 everyone were, and everyone were saying totally different history. They missed it. Yeah, the, uh, of the, the course. Uh -huh. that, that is part of the process. <laughs> okay. So, okay. So, uh, do you like the, the, the practice, guys? <laughs> yeah that was interesting right all right yeah. okay so now this is going to be your homework okay i want you guys to well to write down a little story each of you a little story about anything that happens and try to be like creative right it is your imagination but not too much right kirby not too much <laughs> all right and also marito <laughs> and uh, basically we're going to tell each of us the story and then we're going to vote which story would you think it was the most important if no one was important but the most amazing one okay right. it, it could be a real how story many how many lines how many yeah. lines um it depends um it could be up to two paragraph that means eight um, lines in total do you so want have a main topic or no 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 is uh any story you can invent it but it could be real okay. Uh, okay. All right All doesn't right. matter are you going to evaluate if we okay. use a pass uh yes continue, uh, in mm. simple pass okay. of course that's the oh, purpose okay. of that uh-huh and also i will evaluate um <laughs> your speedness how many oh. words you use it your your extended vocabulary I'm going to evaluate that. And also, guys, I want you to do me a favor. I don't want to that you read it in front of the class. I want you to share it. Like right now, like we are face to face. I want that. Can I say it now? No. Like a, like a report. <laughs> like a report. Like a report it. Exactly. Like, hey, uh, this is like uh, curving uh, reporting for e uh, a corporative English. Today, we're going to talk about like, you know what, like that, like that way, mm -hmm. like a reporter. Like a reporter okay. Exactly. So basically, guys, I want you to, to be like, uh, I don't know, like a storyteller, right? Yes. I don't want you to like read, okay, well, this is about this and there's no way. I don't want mechanic. I want like Can we use a natural pictures way. in the presentation or? Yeah, you can use it. Use your imagination, be creative. Okay, I'm going to evaluate okay. a lot, but uh, most of it, I'm going to evaluate the fluency of the speaking, that you use the two kind of versions that we have learned so far, and also your vocabulary. And as well, if you do not repeat the same phrase like then and then and then, no. I want you to know if you have a uh, knowledge about linking words or something like linking that. Linking words. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. All righty, guys. So, oh, it, hey, how was your day? Was it good? Do you like the stories? Yeah? And the practice? Yeah, it, it was okay. a good activity. All righty, cool. So, tomorrow I will be really excited to hear about your stories, guys, that I cannot imagine. So, please surprise me, okay? Surprise me, Do you go an extra mile. This is the last week, guys. So let's rock. On Thursday, we're going to say bye-bye. <laughs> All righty. OK, guys. So wish you a great night, sweet drinks, hugs, and kisses. See ya. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.